Alrighty. I'm live. It's 30 degrees up here. So it's quite hot. Not as hot as the utmost temperature I've faced, but it's still quite hot. So I'm not sure how long I can hold on. But at least for the co for the comic. Uh, Good evening to you. First, have to send this to someone else. And per usual, if something private is being mentioned, I won't read it out loud. Even if that is as simple as if people are at home or not. Okay, it's been approved. And of course I know this video is going to be uploaded in YouTube in about half a year's time. But still, this is still on Twitch for about a week. And I don't want people to use information that could hurt people in real life. So feel free to put it in the chat because as far as I know the chat isn't being recorded. But I won't mention it on stream. So 
I don't know how things are with you, but it was super hot the past few days. Hence why I couldn't 3D print. Which is a shame because I really want to try something out. But maybe the temperature is less tomorrow. I've also been felt by back pain. And it is getting better, but still don't have the best back. That's one of the reasons why I might not be able to uh, do some extra after the streams. I got some dedicated stuff for my uh, new uh, streaming place. Still have to get a few knives, but I should have a few spare ones here. Yeah, there's a few spare ones over there. And uh, there's some uh, material testing I want to do. And that needs drying time. And I want to get, uh, well, technically a third webcam for streaming use. I know I can use my uh, phone for it, but I want to uh, have, uh, well, less signals to be disturbed. Hence why I prefer cables. So that uh, I have one dedicated uh, near my 3D printer to keep an eye on that. And when I uh, actually move with my studio to my miniature studio, oh, I forgot to put away the buttons. There we go. Um, I can have a dedicated stream camera. Worst thing that can happen is that I have an extra webcam I might uh, donate later on. So I know I can use my phone for it. Um, I just have bad experience with mounting cameras uh, from phones. I know it's very doable and a lot of people do it. I just don't have good experience with that. So And maybe I can do some more real life art streams again. Or cross streams. I just have to reorganize everything. I mean I had my studio studio away from home and now it's going to be a studio in home. More or less. Well, people are surprising me a lot with turtles uh, the past few days. 
even did an annual art exchange and that person included the turtle as well so it's really nice that people think of me when uh, when they're seeing turtles yeah, this this is not working this needs to be very closer Editing wise, I uh, finished two thirds of book five in Dutch. So that's going nicely, just 25 episodes and well, somewhat extras left. Uh, craft wise, I need to continue the source that were ordered. I think I only need to uh, put a varnish uh, over them and then I can uh, make pictures, do suggestions, all that jazz. So pardon me. And I do want to do a lot, but considering I, well, let, let's just say uh, you have back pain that you cannot move and need medicine. And I discovered this right in time. So I wouldn't get that far, but that me did mean immediate rest, no lifting, and that that really sucks if you have to do uh, a moving uh, situation. Had a new student for one uh, day. It was very interesting. I know it that doesn't sound very positive, but. It was very interesting because um, that child, they had a very different ID and style of what I'm used to. So uh, I, I drew humans for a change, actual living humans. Didn't go for realism that much, but more how can you draw them looking a bit realistic. So that was fun to do. Uh, I'm trying to remember what I did last Sunday. I think it was too hot to do anything. And of course with my back there was not more that I could do anyway, so... But it seems we've all been uh, very crafty. Seriously, I can't remember what I did last Sunday. I did some editing. Really, what else did I do? Right, and I believe I did some art. Art for a future project. If I recall well anyway, because <coughs> my memory isn't that great. But I think I mostly did editing.
and of course resting considering my bad back and uh, while having a bad back is mostly genetical and all that thing uh, mine was also enhanced or actually degraded by working too hard and lifting a lot of heavy things that were too heavy for me and an employer who said nah that's just part of the job so yeah I technically ruined my hips and my back by working hard also my shoulders but at least they are uh, knocking on wood decent at the moment I really can't seem to remember what I did Sunday except editing. Must have done more. I mean, editing does go slow, but not that slow that I need a complete day. Oh well. That's not a good space. Yeah, that's way too big, way too big. Let's try it from the other side. Oh, good thing I can turn my screen. But it's still not working. Let's get an extra sketch. Maybe that helps. That's way too thick. And a bit lower. Well, I hope you had fun over there. Like I said, I won't mention anything that can identify an address, a location, a presence. That's just private information. I think the neck needs to be a bit wider. Alright, I remember going to a barbecue first day, and it was okay. I 
I'm not much of a f barbecue fan. Save, hydrate because it's super hot up here. And as you can see, I'm having the Summer Penny VTuber up. I believe this video is going to be up in December or something like that. Uh, for now, the unplanned craft and art streams, uh, live art streams are going to be uploaded in between almost immediately after they've been uh, done because I simply have half a year of stock and otherwise I just have two years of videos uh, stock and Nothing relevant at the moment, so uh, that'll be uh, for now. Um, how does that look? Let's me look it up. I'm looking for that one. Um, this isn't looking good. There's a moon up here. And a moon up here. It's just one frame, so maybe people will get it, maybe people won't. That's okay by me. But I do notice when it's as hot as, well, this, then my lines are even less consistent. Mm, how about giving it... Before I forget that, I forgot to do what I can find. Okay, 
Here we go again. Oh, drawing heads is a thing today. Okay, the head is fine, it's just the position is way too high. I could use some rain right now to cool things off. Hmm. I don't know uh, when they're expecting rain. I don't think they expected rain here. Tomorrow, let's see. Well, there are even a few clouds in the area. <sighs> there might be a little bit of rain around 10 today. And let's see, tomorrow, oh, there might be some rain in the morning, wouldn't mind that. And some rain in the morning on Thursday. And then it's dry and hot again. But climate change isn't real. Would it be bad if uh, if it rained while you're in the cinema? Because I mean, you're inside then. Also, which movie do you plan to look? If you're comfortable sharing that anyway. Ah, uh, what, what I always to prevent to get a wet bicycle seat is putting a little bag on top of it. But try finding bags nowadays. And I also have a little, uh, little towel in my uh, saddlebags. No, you, you don't buy the covers to uh, keep your bicycle seat dry. You put them over to keep a soft bum or something because you don't take those covers off. I mean, I've never seen anyone take those covers off as a whole. I haven't heard of that movie yet. Oh, if it's horror, then uh, I'm not not interested. I already get nightmares of Jurassic Park, so uh, I don't think uh, horror is my uh, cup of tea.
Hmm. I'm not really interested in uh, elemental that much. Um, because it does sound kind of cliche, but sometimes that's a nice movie. Uh, I might be interested in Indiana Jones 5 just for the funs of it. I know the Indiana Jones are sometimes completely far-fetched, but yeah, it's okay. Here we go again. Mm, that's actually a nice one. Just a bit. Well, that that doesn't. That's not good. I have a sneeze, so I'm muting for a moment. And I'm back. Ah, yes, I heard of those subscription services, or abonnementen. I know someone else who has one, and they go to the movie really a lot, especially uh, during the day when it's calm. And then they boast about being the only one in the cinema at that moment, while at the same time proclaiming people should preserve the planet, stop wasting energy, and all that things. And I'm like, you're going to the cinema, you're the only one there. If that's not a waste of resources, then I don't know. So I'm fine with people going to the cinema and enjoying their movies. But don't pretend to be all green and then go to the cinema and be the only one. Because then you could have also got a movie, watched it at home, that was a lot cheaper and a lot better for the, for the environment. I actually have the same feeling with people uh, who love the Formula 5. I'm okay with people liking Formula 5, but if they at the same time proclaim they are very green and do everything they want for the Earth, I think that's a bit uh, two-sided. <sighs> Almost there. Ooh. Hydrate. We should make a drinking game. Turns out, by the way, I have uh, about 112 subscribers on YouTube now. But every couple of days I suddenly get a, a subscriber. And after I upload a video, I get a few more. I don't get more upvotes, I don't get more likes, I don't get more comments. I just get more subscribers. I'm still thinking those 112 are bots. 
I, I honestly can't think of who would want to watch my stream archive. But let's enjoy it at the moment. Yeah, I know uh, you are at least one of the real ones. But I don't expect you to uh, watch the archive if you're already in the stream. That would be that would be uh, more useful things with your time. Of course, you are welcome to check them again or have them uh, up when you're uh, crafting for yourself. But okay, that that is a wonderful hand. I'm not going to be able to reproduce that, so what we do is we copy, and we paste, and we flip it. There we go. Perfect little hand, love it. A couple of things I want to draw. I want to uh, make a forever young themed band inspired image. So that's a forever young uh, modern things with all the characters in a modern setting. And I want a beach image. I mean, formal is something that happens in the story more than once, so that's not really out of the box or, well, different for my characters. But yeah, beach and uh, music are the two I actually want to draw one day. And maybe even more modern settings, maybe even high school. But I kind of already did. Uh, I did a Fashion February, where I sketched all the characters in modern clothes. And maybe a new Halloween one. I did a Halloween one once. Gaming. I don't think gaming would fit that much. And since they're already a fantasy setting, that fantasy wouldn't fit that as well. Maybe the, the classic Dungeons and Dragons. I mean, Clover would be the barbarian, that would be obvious. Blade would be the fighter. Ah, let's sketch again. And I mean, Sushi is an elf, but she's also a witch, so... But yeah, I think I want to do some modern settings with those characters. I 
I did uh, a sketch of them all as mermaids, so I already did that. To be honest, the mermaid setting was kind of boring. I mean, mermaids are amazing, but it's just same characters with tails. Did have a few that some were more uh, shark based. The air users were more. Uh, Let's see, the air users were flying fish based. And I believe the fire user was more sprite based. So yeah, that's a been there done that. I need to decorate the shirt. Maybe this is one of those uh, art dip art block things. Maybe that's the reason why my lines aren't very great. Already working for 35 minutes on it. Uh, lock the layer so I won't be using the wrong layer for coloring. Save the file. Future eyes fish. Do you mean a uh, future futuristic like Star Trek, or do you mean an outfit they will you wear in the future themselves? Because if I do a modern day uh, character, that is already quite futuristic for them. And future outfits, they get new outfits all the time. So. Pretty much every time I draw them, they get new outfits, because they don't have one outfit, they have more than one. Because unlike those anime series, the characters have more than one outfit. Because I like designing clothes. Though I prefer creating summer clothes opposed to winter clothes, but... They do have them. So she wouldn't allow them to uh, wear two seasons the same thing. But you'd only understand that if you read the novel. Uh, that's a bit too grey. Okay. Back in time. That is actually a very interesting concept, which I can't tell more about of because back in time is very important to the plot. So that's all I'm gonna say about it. So that might actually be interesting. But I cannot release an image of that before 
all seven novels have been published. Technically, when and uh, until the sixth one is published, but let's get a little bit of margin of error. No idea how the back in time variant looks like. I would probably get more modern clothes like we have. Oh, you mean that kind of uh, into a uh, human past. So not story-wise past, but I actually already did that once. With uh, shampoo art, by the way. Was part of the... Uh, Sketch challenge, sketching uh, four things a day. I guess I already drew so much, I, there's not much for me left for me to draw, there's plenty to draw, don't worry. Right, I forgot a bit about the symbol, so unlock the layer. There we go, and lock the layer. Something I need to draw by hand anyway. Complain, complain, it's super hot up here. Well, it's still 30 degrees up here, so if this was a competition, which it isn't, I had one. The positive thing about a well-isolated home is that it's not that cold in the winter. The downside of a well-isolated home is it's super hot in the summer and it holds a lot of the heat despite windows being open 24-7 when, uh, when we're at home anyway. Hmm. 
Oops, apparently I missed a spot somewhere. Not seeing it, but okay, apparently. This solves it as well. Drinking time! Yeah, that's something you really need to do in this heat. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. I am a bit worried that uh, if I make this comic, the police will think uh, if anything ever explodes, <laughs> maybe we have something to do with it. Right, and I decided to make her face a bit more darker, otherwise it always looks as if he has a hole in his shirt. Plus it matches more the shirt I got for him, so... I also have a few new uh, wax stamps on their on its way. And some other supplies.
few gifts. Some supplies for crafting, for the wax. Yeah, mostly for our new wax seals are on its way. Wait, I already had that one. But I already have it. Oh well, that should be resolved in an hour or eleven. Strange that despite it being so hot and moist, well, my eyes are so dry. Which, is, by the way, also makes sense, I know, it's super hot and all. Okay, background time. Now I get distracted easily, but the heat does not make it any easier for me. That's a whole part of a got to color. But that's okay, I will do that afterwards. That's not... Forget that. I will do that by hand. First, I'm gonna color this before I forget. Maybe I'm going for a bit toxic green. bit more bright but make it a bit more soft so you probably don't see anything of it anyway but that's okay Already found a typo.
I really want to get out of this heat. Just have to triple check it. Pikrina, Pikrina. And this can be smaller because it's not very interesting. Okay, so text check time. I think I'm hearing the lovely sound of rain. Probably isn't much, but hey. Rain is rain. Okay, the other people have it in their own screens. Can still change it if needed. Ah, memory full. Uh, how about I open this one as well? Doesn't happen often that Alex is the only one in a comic. Mm, let's have him poking around. I think there's even a little bit of thunder in here. Which I would be okay with. I mean, thunder is usually a sure way to uh, make us colder. Um, da -da -da -da. I'm looking for this one. Yep, that's definitely rain.
definitely rain. It's the 11th? 11th. Right, I closed something and I shouldn't have closed it because I still needed it. Oh well, now we reopen it. Thank you. Okay, so this is happening. Yeah, I think I'm going for this. And hydrate! Okay, waiting for one more text check. Okay, it's been super hot, it's 1 hour and 15 minutes, so I've been slow as well, so that means I'll be sending this off to the publisher and escape this heat up here. I still have to wait a bit because uh, it has to upload on YouTube, but at least... Uh, I don't have to wear this hot headset. So, I'll be talking to you, to you. Maybe, very maybe, depends on my back, depends on the temperature, depends on what happens on the day. I can stream a bit on Thursday or Sunday. 
but I won't be able to predict that and say that for sure until the time is there. So I'll be seeing you. Bye bye. Oh wait, may maybe I can do something. Bye bye. Oh wait, that, that that looks horrible. Oh, that looks horrible. Bye bye. No, no, no not gonna do this. Not gonna do this. Bye.